Hey folks, we're up here in the mountain right now burning some time waiting for a bear to come out. And we're scrolling through some of my feeds about questions on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, a lot of questions about gear that we use to film the TV show. And I'm not going to talk about it. I'm going to let Marcus and Michael talk about it. Because I don't know how to use this stuff. To me, this could just as well be about a 22-pound mm, boat anchor. Uh, a very expensive, probably seven, eight thousand dollar, twenty-two pound boat anchor, but uh, <clears throat> they're going to tell you what we use and why we use it. But also, they're going to tell you what you should use, how you don't need to spend a fortune to film your own hunts. So I'm not usually in front of the camera because I'm usually behind the camera. So the camera we use is a Sony PXW Z150. Um, it's a newer camera by Sony. It's very good for the run and gun type of situation where you need to react quickly to a scenario. Um, we can zoom in really fast, achieve focus, acquire the target very quickly. It has microphone inputs on the side. So these are XLR inputs. You can plug in high quality microphones using that. Right here we have a lavalier mic which it wirelessly transmits to the microphone on your talent, like this microphone you can see on my collar, and I have the bottom part down here. So that plugs into the camera. We also have another one that plugs into a shotgun microphone up top. The tripod we use is a Benro S8 um, with carbon fiber legs, and uh, we always have headphones to monitor our audio. That way, anything that's coming through the camera and these microphones, we can monitor live through that, and that's very critical to, uh, for how we do things. Uh, the thing with this camera, though, is it doesn't come cheap. This camera runs you about $3,200. This microphone and cradle setup and um, windscreen is going to be over $700, probably $800. Um, the lavalier mic on the side is going to run you about $650. These headphones are $100. This tripod is $650. So by the end of it, you're, you're looking at a pretty good chunk of change uh, in camera setup. There's going to be a different setup that's going to work best for what you're going to, what you're going to do. And this, this happens to be what works best for us. I mean, it's definitely, there's a lot, there's a lot higher end cameras out there, but for the price point, this one is what we use. All right, now that Marcus has shown you what we use, we're gonna show you how you can put together a camera kit to film your own hunts that's not gonna break the bank. So in the next video, we're gonna talk about these pieces of equipment that we think are an intersection of price, yet value, in other words, how good they work, and some ideas of how you can probably utilize some of your existing equipment, whether it's your current camera, whether it's the tripod that you currently use for your spotter, whatever it might be to save some money, not have to carry any additional gear, and produce your own really cool hunting story.